to another video. Hey, I am Lizanne. If you are new, welcome to my channel. I am happy to have you. For this video, I thought I would do another episode of creating famous people on The Sims 4. If you are new to my channel, I started this series where I create famous people on The Sims 4. Episode 1, we created Marilyn Monroe. Episode 2, we created Blake Lively. And I created a playlist that I will link down below if I can for you guys to enjoy if you want to watch the other episodes as well. So for episode 3 of Let's Create Famous People, we are going to be creating Lucy Hale. A lot of you wanted me to make her, and I had a lot of fun. She is one of my favorite actresses, and I think it, I think she really looks, I think my sim really looks like her. I had a lot of fun making her, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. So let's go upstairs and let's create Lucy Hale on the sim. Welcome to my Create a Sim in The Sims 4. For this video, episode 3 of Creating Famous People on The Sims 4, we are creating Lucy Hale. She has been highly requested, so let's get started. I am a huge fan of Lucy. She is one of my favorite actresses, and I probably will watch anything that she is in. I absolutely love her. Um, Lucy's real name is Karen Lucille Hale, but we all know she goes by Lucy. Comment down below if any of you actually knew her real name was Karen. I definitely didn't. She is an American actress and country singer. She was born and raised in Tennessee before moving to LA to act and sing when she was 15. Her favorite colors are green, blue, rainbow, and pink. She has two dogs, Elvis and Ethel. Elvis is the oldest, but we will not be creating them because it just takes up too much time. Her favorite accessories include sunglasses, eyeliner, and Gucci handbags. I don't have any Gucci handbags or any handbags for that matter in my game, but we will definitely be including sunglasses and eyeliner. Lucy has acted in a lot of TV shows and movies over the years. Some of my favorites are Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants 1 and 2. Those are my absolute favorite movies. They're my top five. I love those movies. I will watch those anytime. I probably know them word for word. Cinderella, Once Upon a Song. Oh wait, I'm sorry. Let's go back to Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants 1 and 2. She wasn't an actual, like, she wasn't a main character. She was L Lena Lena's um, younger sister. I'm just putting that out there. Okay, anyways, <laughs> Cinderella Once Upon a Song, that is a really good one. I know there's a lot of Cinderella stories out there, but one Cinderella Once Upon a Time is a really good one. Um, I think she loses like her iPod or something like that, so it's a little different than losing her shoe, so it makes it really cool. And I think her name is Katie instead of Cinderella. And then of course, Pretty Little Liars. We all love Pretty Little Liars. If you haven't watched Pretty Little Liars, you live under a rock. Go watch Pretty Little Liars. You have to watch Pretty Little Liars. Aria and Hannah are my absolute favorite in those. I love them. I love Arya. Katie Keene and Life Sentence were really good ones before they got cancelled. And she guest starred on Wizards of Waverly Place as Justin Russo's goth girlfriend. I thought that was really cool. She is so young in it and if you don't know her really well, or don't watch a lot of her movies, you probably won't know that it's her, but she is in Wizards of Waverly Place in like a couple episodes. Um, there's a lot more of her movies, but those are my top favorites. 
My favorite songs by her would be Bless Myself, Make You Believe, Sound Good To Me, and Mistletoe. We love a good Christmas song. Bless Myself is a really good song about loving yourself and learning to feel good about yourself, to bless yourself. Make You Believe and Sound Good To Me are from a Cinderella Once Upon a Song. At least Make You Believe is, I, I'm not sure if Sound Good To Me is, but Make You Believe is definitely from Wizard, from Cinderella Once Upon a Song. Her hobbies include being outdoors. She loves anything to do with outdoors. Absolutely loves hiking and shopping, and she will go until she drops. She absolutely loves a good shopping or hiking day. She flies home to Tennessee any chance she gets to spend time with her family. She has a huge passion for photography, for, for photography and loves to cook. She absolutely loves to cook. It's one of her most favorite passions. She also has 14 tattoos, including a matching one with the Pretty Little Liars cast. They all got their letter of their character on their fingers, so of course she got an A for Aria. Allison got an A for Allison, you know, and so on. Ashley Benson got a H for Hannah. You get the picture. But I thought that was really cool that they all got those matching tattoos. They got it on their sh finger, so when they do the sh, you can see it. I thought that was really cute. Another tattoo of hers I love. I absolutely love this one. It's an I love you in her grandmother's handwriting on her arm. It inspired me to actually get my grandmother my grandmother's handwriting when she passed away I got a blue rose with I love you as the tail in my grandmother's handwriting and that was inspired by Lucy Hale's grandmother's tattoo absolutely love it it's one of my favorite tattoos I'm not going to talk about her other tattoos you can go look them up if you want to she has so many she has so many of them <laughs> Um, she dyes her hair a lot, a lot. I'm not really sure what her natural hair color is right now, but I like light brown Lucy, so that is the color that we went with. She is into wearing sportswear and being comfy, so we are giving her a nice little sporty look. And then we'll do a nice little fancy look as soon as we find a nice shirt to go with her leggings. Just find the right top. I absolutely love this top, but I won't be using it for her today. Maybe we will use it for another famous person. In the end, I go with this cute little tank top, white and purple. It's one of my favorites, absolutely love it. It's so casual and totally Lucy. Then we're just gonna add in some shoes and socks. Just these white trainers. We're going to give her a nice little cute jean and long sleeve moment. Once I find the right jeans, here they are. Absolutely love these jeans. I put all my sims in these jeans. And then we find a cute little long sleeve shirt. I know exactly which one I am looking for. Not this top. 
Ah, this one. This one is perfect. Absolutely love this top. It is one of my favorites. And we're going to put it in pink because her favorite color is pink. And then we'll just give her these cute little tie-up shoes. These are my favorite shoes. Absolutely love these. And we'll do them in a nice white color. And then we're going to throw her in a cute little skirt and wear the same shirt in a different color moment. Just find my favorite skirt. We will put it in pink again because that's one of her favorite colors. And there's a lot of pink in The Sims 4. And I'm just scrolling through the tops, but we will go back to my favorite top in a minute. Or do we not use my long sleeve top? Oh no, we use this one. This one is a really cute top as well. And then we give her these cute knee-high socks. And some knee-high boots. I think these socks are so cute. You can put them with flowers, but we'll just give her some nice black ones. And then we're giving her another fancy look. I love this skirt as well. I use it for all my spooky sims. This is one of my favorite skirts. I recently downloaded it and it's my go-to. I absolutely love it. All my sims wear it. <laughs> you just find a cute little top and we change the color of the socks and the boots, I think. Yes. Here's my favorite top again, and we use it in black, I think. Or do we switch it? White. We use it in a white color. And we change the boots to a nice little brown to match the belt. And the socks, I think we change them, yeah, to like a, to a white color. She is so cute. There are her outfits, absolutely beautiful. Add in some sunglasses. To complete her look, not all her outfits will have sunglasses. I think I just put them on two. Yes, I just put them on two of her outfits. She is so cute. I think she looks absolutely beautiful. I think she does look like Lucy Hale. Let me know down below if you think she looks like Lucy Hale. Now let's just create her walk. And she's an actor, so we'll make her an actress. And her traits are loves outdoors. She's creative. And she's a dog lover, of course, because she's got two dogs. No, instead of creative, she's cheerful. I'm sorry. She's a very happy person. Her favorite colors are in a rainbow, so we'll use blue, pink, and black, and green. She loves to cook. She loves to bake. She loves acting. She loves the guitar. She loves to paint. And she loves singing. And that is Lucy Hale. I hope you guys enjoy. I had really fun creating her. Before I go, a fun fact about Lucy Hale is that she's obsessed with unicorns. And I'm just adding her to the gallery for those who play The Sims and would love to play with her. My username is Bestie Sims. I will have it linked down below if you want to check her out and play with her. 
and that will be the end of this video that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me while i play the sims 4 and we make lucy hail leave your comments down below give this video a big thumbs up follow me on twitter and instagram those are always down there subscribe to be an hallucinator, I would be happy to have you. And always remember that a little magic always goes a long way. And I'll speak to you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.